Hello everyone, my name is Pam and I want to welcome you to my channel. Today is my very first video of some of the things that I purchase on a consistent basis to sell in my Poshmark closet as well as some on eBay. I don't do much on eBay at this point, mainly it's Poshmark. Um, it's easy on Poshmark, it's fun, the shipping is so much easier. So I wanna thank any of my buyers that may be on here watching this video today. You have made it so fun for me in the last six months. I've had some great purchases, fantastic reviews, so thank you very much. I truly appreciate your business. Um, I primarily, like I said, sell on Poshmark and the things that I sell in there are going to be women's clothes, men's clothes, um, some infant and toddler, not very much, just still getting into that, um, shoes and purses. And I pick up items that are going to be either new with tags, brand new without tags, um, or something that somebody has worn maybe once or twice. I don't pick up any damaged items. Um, I bring everything home and before I list it, I wash it, I steam it. I make sure that when it goes out the door, it is coming to you in fantastic condition, hopefully like new condition. I wanna sell you the things that I would hope to get for myself as well. So um, today is going to be one of the first hauls that I'm gonna show you. I have so many, I have lots of videos that I will be putting out, but I have so many great things that I wanna share. Um, quite a few free people items and please know that I'm fairly new at this. So I would love and welcome any of your comments. If I get some things wrong, I don't know the names of things properly. I, you know, I watch other videos and people are getting corrected all the time and I welcome that because I'm learning from you guys. And that's actually how I got started on this by watching other people's videos. So let's get started. First thing I want to, um, show you guys is this sleeping on snow i believe it's anthropology and this is an off the shoulder sweater it is pink and white it's some like a pinkish purple very very pretty long sleeve like a bell sleeve super pretty um it would be really nice to be worn at like a tunic and with some leggings or with some skinny jeans and some boots. Very, very pretty, super soft. Absolutely love this one. And then I have this Free People, which I absolutely adore. And I will tell you, I'll probably say that a lot because I love everything I pick up. And it's really, really hard to sell these things because I really want to keep them all for myself. So this one right here, as we all know, Free People, or if you don't know, Free People is way oversized. So this is a small, it would definitely fit small, medium, and large for sure. Um, this one again has the big sleeves. Um, you see, very oversized. The back is so pretty. Look at the back of this. Hopefully you can see that properly. Yeah, so this one will look great with um, a tank top underneath, off the shoulder, super pretty, free people. Um, and then the other free people item that I have, oh, and this was an amazing find. I had a hard time finding this one, but I finally found it in a local store um, not too far from where I live about, I would say 25 minutes from where I live. So I guess maybe that is kind of far, but for me, not so much. Anyway, free people cardigan. Look at this guys. This is the long line. Um, I forget the name of it. I forget the name, but anyhow, again, super oversized, size small, super pretty. Look at these colors. Absolutely beautiful. This thing is Stunning on. There's no pockets on this, but the knit on this is so pretty and it's super, super great shape. I did do a little sweater shaving on this one um, because it has um, the material itself. It's got alpaca in it, wool. I think it has some acrylic, I think, but I'm, I'm not positive. This one is listed, um, but this one. Brand new, I think it was 
or so for this one um, and very hard to find. So I do love that one. Another free people piece, which I absolutely adore, and this is new without tags. This one was never worn um, unless I decide to wear it because I think this is so pretty. Look at the sleeves, nice bell sleeve on this one. I think that's what they're called, right? Bell sleeves. Um, and then look at the knit on this thing or crochet, crochet, right? Super, super beautiful. Again, correct me if you know the proper terms for these, because I'm like, I think it's crochet or is it embroidered? I don't know. Um, and then the bottom here, the hem is more of a raw hem. And look at the pretty, pretty blue and the buttons, gorgeous. Also size small. I do have some other free people, but I'll show those in another one. I don't think I include any more in this one. And then I have a Banana Republic black basic sweater, Italian Merino yarn by Barufa, size large, women's super great shape, um, worn once or twice, she said, um, just perfect condition. Just a basic black sweater, Italian wool, extra fine. One of those super nice finds that I personally love anything Italian, anything. I absolutely love it. I also have these Chico's Travelers. If you are not familiar with Chico's Travelers, I definitely recommend it. I personally do a lot of traveling and I want my clothes to be super comfortable. I want them to be wrinkle free. And that's what Chico's Travelers is. It's a super fantastic line. Now these are in a really great size. These are a size three, which I believe is an extra large, I believe. Um, don't quote me on that, but I believe it is. I did model these and they are listed on my Poshmark closet. So you can kind of see how they hang. They are somewhat sheer, but you can't see through them if you're wearing dark undergarments, which is really nice. And they are flowy, just really nice. It's got a button and a zipper. And again, as you can see, it's Chico's. These are brand new with tags, so they've never been worn. Pendleton, this is a Baja Surf pullover with a hood. Super, super soft, really nice colors. Now this is a large petite, but again, this is another one that I modeled because I wanted to show Oh, like the, I'm going to go back to this real quick. The reason I modeled those Chico's pants is because they are size three short, but I'm five foot six. And when I put them on, they hit the top of my foot and I even put heels on them um, with them and they don't look short on me. If you're five foot six, they're not going to look short on you either. If you're taller, um, they might come up. If you're five, seven, five, eight, maybe they'll come up to your ankle, but those literally hit the top of my foot. And again, with this one, this one is a large petite, but this fit me just like a normal sweater would fit me. So it hit in the appropriate spot. So large petite, I'm, I don't know, but that's what it says. So the hoodie, really nice quality. Again, I, this one feels like, looks, feels like it was maybe worn one time. Nothing wrong with that one, it's perfect. This, etc. Skirt, size four, 95% cotton. Super, super good quality black basic skirt. These pockets are actually really cool. I wonder if you can actually see the pocket. I'm gonna get up a little closer because black is so hard. See how it's a round pocket? Very interesting, very different. There's the back. Oh, it's got some lint on it. That's not a defect. The skirt is in perfect condition. Um, zipper. I dry cleaned it. Um, if the items need to be dry cleaned, again, they don't have tags on them. I will dry clean them. They're going to go out to you in perfect condition. Well, as close as perfect I can get. I shouldn't say that. Not every time. Here, let's go to one of my infant items. Oh, look at how stunning this is. Adorable little size, six month, brand new dress. These 
gold little polka dots. Can you see the bow? Where's the bow? Oh, there's the bow. There's the bow. Look at how pretty this is. This would be so nice for pictures, for a wedding, for Christmas, any type of event. So I'm pretty new in this baby stuff, but when I find really cute items, I have to pick it up. You guys talk about cute. Look at this little bunny outfit. Super, super soft, new with tags. Got a little bunny head on it. It's just lovely. It's got the little hand cover so they don't rip their face off with their tiny little nails. Oh, okay. Another holiday dress. You guys, look, look at this little stunner. I think this was originally from Saks Fifth Avenue. You're not gonna be able to see how beautiful this is um, in the particular lighting that I have, or maybe you will. Can you see the sequins in there? Brand new, never worn, does not have, oh, you can see the detail, cool. Yeah, this is gorgeous. And then the inside of this, these are little snaps, by the way. The inside is all lean, lined, excuse me, lined in faux fur. Super, super, super soft, super beautiful. A little girl is going to look like a princess, absolute princess. It's a size medium. All right, what else we got here? Oh, Victoria's Secret Pink. Brand new yoga pants. These do have tags. Uh, I believe these are small. Yep, these are size small. Yoga pants. See the wider, the wider bottom. Got the little dog on it. So just basic yoga pants. And then we have some Duluth trading yoga pants. A lot more than just yoga pants on these. Obviously, if you're familiar with Duluth trading, you can wear these for pretty much everything. Um, they have just your basic stretchability. It's got the side pockets, a couple of back pockets, um, wider leg on the bottom. I thought it had a gusset. I believe it. no it doesn't but yeah so that's these these are really nice fantastic condition I'm gonna say those were probably worn a couple of times uh, I didn't see any damage but they did they did feel like they had been washed previous so um, these are lucky brand dungarees I also modeled these because these are kind of hard for to envision. Like when you take a look at the picture on my Poshmark, oh, they look terrible. It's nothing I would ever buy. So I went ahead and modeled them to show what they'll actually look like. They are faded. They are lower rise, but they're not that low. They are a flare. And I believe they're called vital flare. Yes, Vital Flare. And these are size 29 or size eight, and they're long. But when you look at the pictures, um, I was wearing a little bit of a heel, but if I were to decide not to wear a heel, they'd also look good. So even though they're long, they weren't that long. I would say if you were 5'7", five, 5'8", five, they're going to fit at the top of your foot. For me, um, they did hit the floor, but with heels on, they did not, so they were perfect. And then we have a pair of Not Your Daughter's jeans in a size 12. This is the Maryland Straight. So these are more sought after. These are in a, in a gray, very little distressing. The only distressing that it has is a little bit on the pockets. I hope you can see that. Um, and again, it's just your straight leg. So yeah, sought after. Not your daughter's jeans, um, Maryland Straight. I heard the Maryland Straight is one of the better sellers for that particular brand. This one here is Lacoste, and it is a really nice gray, heavier material. Not super heavy where it would feel like it would be super hot, um, but it's nice. But Lacoste is always extremely structured and really nice. 
Um, the sleeves are meant to be rolled up. You could see a little bit of, of a lining there. That's my chair, sorry. Um, yeah, so there you go with this one. And then we have another Chico's. And I would say Chico's is um, free people, Chico's, anthropology. Those are the things that I really love to pick up. This is a Chico size three. And for me, the bigger sizes in the Chico's is really what I try to find. Um, and this is a gorgeous burgundy sweater knitted. They're short sleeve. The back is just, just knitted. And then the pockets, you can see the pockets right there. This one's gorgeous. I love it. It's, it's great, 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 great quality. It is heavy, um, substantially, I should say. I keep saying structure, but I mean substantial. Um, and I think it's beautiful. These Zaya leggings, I actually bought these for myself. And unfortunately, they're not as long as I wanted. I, I like to wear the longer leggings. I'm not into the ones that come up to the ankle or cropped or any of that stuff. Um, I just like them longer because I don't just wear them for working out. So these didn't work out for me, unfortunately, because I paid up for these, which makes it really hard. But um, these are a size six, eight, and they have the scrunch butt. I have never had a pair of scrunch butt before. So I've seen many videos where these ladies are rocking these and like the picture of these looked super good. Now, maybe it was just her butt that they look super good on, but I thought I was going to give it a whirl. Um, they do look really nice on. They're great quality. I think these are brand new. She did not have tags on them, and I don't remember when I bought them if she said they were brand new or not, but I believe they were. Um, but they don't feel like they've ever been worn. Now, since I did open them and I tried them on, I did wash them. I washed them on Gentle Cycle and for a very short period of time, but again, if they touch my body or I know they've touched someone else's, I'm going to send them to you clean couple of bathing suit pieces that I picked up is this um, Bottoms by Catherine Mel Meldrino, Mel Melandria, I don't know, but I thought it was super cute. Look at it. It's got that high waist, which I think looks so good on. And I love the stripes. I love the color. There's a little heart detail right there. Um, and these are a size small and they do have the little liner still in them. Uh, these, these are small, but I'm thinking if you're a medium, these are going to fit you fantastic. They look kind of big for a small personally, but these I clearly didn't try on. So I'm just saying they look like they're a medium to me, but they are listed as a small. Here's a brand that I absolutely love, and I have a lime green, super gorgeous cover-up. Oh my gosh, these two would actually look beautiful together. Um, anyhow, this is by Paula Her Hermani, Hermani, guava, size large. Y'all, does that look like a large? <laughs> I got nothing more to say. Anyhow, um... <laughs> The gold detail on here, now mind you, these, I, I wish I could rock these, I am way too old for this, but um, the back has that little scrunch on the butt, it's got her little logo there. These are so beautiful, I love them. They also have the protector in there, so you know, upside down, that they've never been worn. Um, Super, super expensive, by the way. This brand is crazy expensive, but super great. And again, I have the lime green. I think I want to show it to you. Please excuse me just a moment while I grab it. Um, yeah, that's this one. And this one... 
Um, <clears throat> here it is. The lime green. And it is size 8. Originally $188. got these beautiful slits. Look how gorgeous this is. That will look fabulous. You guys, this would be fabulous. Anyways, I'm going to put this one back. I have this absolute love for fashion, so you guys excuse me if I get a little bit too excited. Um, I got this on online sourcing, and this is Savage Fenty by Rihanna. The colors, again, are stunning. Oh my gosh, this would look really good with that cover up too. This is not a bathing suit, you guys. This is um, sex and lingerie. Or if you are very daring and want to wear this as a bathing suit, I don't recommend it out in public, but she is pretty. She is pretty. Brand new with the tags. So you don't have to worry about this one either. Um, there's no liner in here, but I don't know if this stuff normally comes with liners, but this was, this was brand new straight out of someone's shipment. So you don't have to worry about that. This one is a Prana men's shirt, just a really nice graphic. It says life on it. I really love that because this is the kind of life that I want to live in the future. I want to travel and, um, I consider keeping this for myself, but it is men's, it is really nice, and it is a size large, so that's great. And I love Prana, love that brand. This one is Outdoor Research, great color. I picked it up because it's a size large. I love the color. Um, apparently, this is a very good brand for men as well. I didn't know that, but now I do. It's that, um, more of a crinkle fabric, kind of. If that makes any sense to you guys. Um, probably doesn't. Crinkle fabric, what do you mean? I don't know. And I don't want to keep this video going for like an hour, so I'm going to hurry up here. Um, Patagonia Men's Organic Cotton. Again, I picked this one up because of style and color, and it's that seam type of crinkle fabric. And I think they're both just 100% cotton. But let me look real quick because, um, yeah, 100% organic cotton. I don't know how it gets that like crinkle texture, but there you go. There's that one. I have this two piece. This was mine as well. Um, it's called New Mix Active fit sports bra i'm gonna do this just because it's easier where's the back there's the front you have the cups and then you have the matching leggings these are a size large really nice really comfortable um for me uh, the bra is too small even though it's a large and the pants because they're large they're not as impressive as because I need a, a medium. So for me, I can't buy sets. I shouldn't have bought the set. Now I have to sell the set. So I got that, which I have to price yet. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do on that. I have this men's tour t-shirt, um, an Australian band um, called Five Seconds of Summer. Uh, honestly, I've never heard of it. I was told this is a great band. I haven't even listened. But it is their... Um, North American tour of 2019 and it just lists everywhere they went in 2019. It's in perfect shape. If somebody wore this, they probably wore it once. Um, they did come to Madison, Wisconsin and they, oh, and they were in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Well, I guess I might actually have to look that up and listen to some of their music just to see. Oh, here is another free people piece. This is intimately free people. This is a bodysuit. Um, and it does have thumb holes, which I love. I actually picked this one up for myself as well. Um, it has the buttons down the front. The arms are nice and long. Again, oversized by free people. And 
It also has the liner in it. This has never been worn. Tags are attached, size medium. J. Crew size six shorts. It's got this eyelet, super pretty. And they are shorts, not a skirt. It almost looks like a skirt. It's got great detail. Um, tie. And then I believe it has a zipper. Yep, it's got a zipper on the side and it has pockets. Zipper, pockets, tie, eyelet. Super pretty, almost looks like a skirt. Made well, this is a skirt. There's a zipper in the front. It's that velvety material. Super cute on. Um, now that it's coming into the fall season, I'm gonna start taking more and more pictures with this because I have a lot of things that kind of match. Size six, super nice. Again, super great quality. I could not find any flaws on that one. Here is a Victoria's Secret pink, three quarter zip. Chicago, thumb holes. I love thumb holes, so quite honestly, if I can find anything with thumb holes that's really great quality, I do pick it up. This is a size small. Oh, these are just Spinks. Um, extra large, great size. The ones that come all the way up onto your bust and um, thigh. So yeah, first time pick, picking up Spanx shapewear for me. I've never picked it up before. This one is an anti-star, new with tag size medium, mock neck, midi, midi dress, sleeveless, super crazy soft, very fitted, looks very, very nice, super. Super incredibly soft. J. Crew white jean. Just a, yeah, just a dress. Back has cute buttons. Pockets. Brand new with tags. Size six. Um, I looked this one up. I don't remember what the price was. Got the extra button, but again, brand new takes. LuLaRoe. Um, to be honest, I don't normally pick this up, but I love anything that's camo. Well, almost anything that's camo. I actually have a jacket too. Um, this is an extra small. I've never worn the row. I hear a lot of controversy, but I know a lot of people love it. So I'm like, mm -hmm, this is really cute. I know it's brand new. It's never been worn. It doesn't have the tags on it, but you can tell this thing's never been worn. Um, nice and crispy still. And when I say crispy, just like you can tell it hasn't been worn and washed. Although I did wash this in Gentle Cycle as well because um, it was not new with tags and you guys know the drill. Uh, extra small, long, Short sleeves, really actually cute. I like it. I do have some bras. Um, I only pick up bras that are in new condition. Um, I wash all of those as well. And I wash them in bra garments. This one is a Kashyyyk 44 double D, bigger size. It's got underwire in fantastic condition. And then I have this brand new tag t-shirt bra. This is a 36D by Hanes. $38 originally. Pretty pink. No underwire. So there's that one. And then sports bras. I do pick up a lot of sports bras. Um, especially Waco. Waco. I love this brand. I think it's called Waco. Um, but again, I pronounce a lot of things wrong. This one is meant for maximum support. I have two different sizes in this one. This is a 36 C it's the pink. And then I have this teal blue. I think it's teal blue or aqua, maybe aqua blue. 
I think this one's a 34. Same brand, 34C. 34C, maximum support. So high impact, basically. And then I have um, this bralette. This bralette is super pretty, actually. It has, oh, here it is. This is a uh, Bali, size large. And I don't think this was ever worn. It's got the convertible strap in the back. Sorry, guys. Hopefully you could see that. And then there, I think I should have moved my camera closer. I'm struggling. Um, just a couple of other little baby things that I picked up. Little diaper covers. Just really cute little diaper covers. And then, oh, little boys, not a couple. Look at the whales on there. Aww. Super cute. Absolutely love that. Oh, and that's a Nautica size five. I picked up this men's Mickey Mouse tie from Disney World. I love it. And I know there's a lot of people, a lot of men who look for this. So when I found that one, it doesn't look like it's ever been worn. I had to pick it up. Nike Air men's t-shirt. Really nice. Again, looks like one that's never been worn, but I did wash. Men's Western wear, cowboy. George Strait collaborate, collaboration with Wrangler. Just a plan. Um, I did do the size on this one because the size tag is missing and I think the fabric tag is missing too. Let me just check. It smells so nice. I buy this soap, this laundry soap from Sendex, um, which is organic and natural and all this other stuff, but it's got it's got essential oils in it and it's just amazing. Oh, it just makes the clothes smell so nice, but it's it's not overwhelming smell, but I like essential oils, so. Anyways, I, I believe the neck on this was 17 and a half. I have a pair of men's um, Joseph A. Bank traveler pants, performance with style, traditional fit, wrinkle resistant, water and stain repellent, slider waistband, shirt gripper, which I thought was really cool. I never knew that there was pants made with shirt grippers. Basically the shirt gripper is that rubber that you would find on like strapless items, like a strapless bra or dress or whatever and to keep it up. These are a 3530, brand new with tags, 109.50 is the cost of those. Um, of course I'm not selling them for 109.50, but I don't know if you can read this stuff because it's so far away. I'll improve on the next videos, I promise. And then I'll fix those later. Um, men's Authentics Signature Levi's. These are just skinny, uh, 32 long, I believe. Um, yeah, so just men's basic Levi's, skinny. These I have listed pretty cheap. I know these are not an expensive brand. Another pair of Levi's, Levi's Signatures. These are, hello, where's the size? All right, Pam, get it together. Thirty-two, thirty-two, Levi's, five fourteen. Should I just? Anywho, I also have these combat pants. These are um, from a military store that sells these for people in the military, combat, tactical, things like that. Um, and these are, they fit various different sizes because they're adjustable. The inseam 32 and a half to 35, waist is 35 to 39 inches. And then it gives you all the instructions on the pocket on how to wash and take care of these and so forth. So those are really nice. Um, brand new Melville dress. This is actually going to be shipped out today. But this is a brand new. It, it was actually worn for a couple of hours. I shouldn't say it was brand new, but it was worn for a couple of hours. Just the basic strappy dress, short, super, super soft. 
that one's being shipped out today, which I gotta do soon. Um, and then I have these little shorts. What tiny little butt scrunch, very basic, I believe. Um, Love and Dreams, something like that. I believe it's an anthropology brand. The North Face. This is a newer, um, a newer one. I think it's called Wasabi. Super freaking soft. It's really nice. Two pockets on the inside, two pockets on the outside. Super beautifully soft. Um, oh, and those, believe I believe these are large. I'm sorry, I'm kind of forgetting some things. Extra large. Those are extra large. And this is a medium. Okay. And we're almost done. And we have this. This is super fun. I will not read it because um, I don't want to get banned. And this is a size large, super cute for St. Patrick's Day. Just a nice little crop top. Women's Chicago, Chicago Bears. This one's a little older, but it's in fantastic condition. Women's Ralph Lauren. Um, like a poncho shawl. Um, it's pullover. You put it over your neck. Um, over your head, I mean. Not over your neck. You know what I mean. There you go. See? It looks really pretty on. I think this would look really nice with, um, you know, like a, a very pretty dress just to cover your shoulders. Uh, it's got these little tassels. Oh, you can't see that. It's too dark. There you go. So it has those, which is nice. This woman's Wonderly shirt. I picked this up because I thought it was so pretty. The colors are really nice. It also is a 2X and I do love picking up some bigger sizes, um, which is just button up shirt. Really nice quality. I love how it feels. Again, it's more of a, um, a substantial piece where the fabric doesn't feel cheap at all when I say that. It's just really nice, really soft, really pretty colors. Another cover-up that I picked up, this one, this one has one tiny little font. I didn't see it until after I picked it up. J. Valdi. So it's just this really pretty blue three-quarter sleeve. Um, slits on the sides, but yeah, just a really pretty little cover up. Um, and the size on this one is not on there, but it, it fits more like a, I would say a medium, possibly a large, but no, I'm going to say medium because you don't want a, a fitted cover up or well, maybe somebody does, but to me anyways, I would say that would be a medium. We the free. So I guess we're another free people. And this one's really nice. It is super light. It's got this roughly flutter sleeve, raw hem on the bottom, little pocket, super light material. Another Chico's. Chico size one, brand new with tags, beautiful sparkly sweater. Um, was originally $99. Can you see it sparkle? You probably can't. There, come closer. Now you can see the sequins. But now it doesn't look pink. Ugh. Anyway, you get the idea. Super pretty. Little tiny side slit. Another Ralph Lauren piece. This one, um, new tags, um, paid up on this one. This is a size 1X. This was not a cheap purchase, wasn't a super expensive purchase. This one was purchased at TJ Maxx for $30. Um, zipper on the side. I think the lighting in here is not so good for this. See, there you go. I don't know, just so you can see, $30 for that one. And did I say it's a 1X? Yeah, so it's a great size. 
A um, couple of other things that I'll just show you real quick and then we're gonna be done with this video because we are now on 39 minutes. Um, Modica Fashion Bag. This is actually a men's bag. They have a really cool line for guys. So this is more of a standard, I would say a computer bag, you know, backpack. But they do have a whole line where you can buy these that look just like this. You can put your products in it, um, your clothes in it, uh, you know, more like suitcase kinds of things. But this one is really nice. It's brand new. Um, there's the inside. The charging cord right here. Um, when I say brand new, it was tried out once. So... Honestly, I guess it's not brand new because it was tried out once and it wasn't the bag that he expected because he needs one just a tad bit bigger um, to put all the toiletries and things in. So um, he upgraded to the bigger. So there's this pocket, this pocket, and I'm opening all of these pockets while I'm talking to you and not showing you. <laughs> so anyways, so yeah, you got your computer pocket in there, side pocket, side pocket charging thing that goes right here and I'm assuming like your phone fits in one of these. There's one on the inside too, like right where this charging thing is. So maybe that's where your phone actually goes. And then the back on this. All right, so that's that's that. Um, I'm gonna show you some, a couple of pairs of shoes, actually three, and then we'll be done with this. So these right here are Born Concepts and just, Super cute, super cute, brand new, only tried on. Um, size, size seven, these are size seven. So those are really nice. And then we have these Harley boots. Love, love, love Harley. And I was really wishing these were in my size. I really have to clean these up yet. I have not done that. It looks like this lady probably wore these a couple of times only. I have to clean this heel off. Um, but yeah, she must have only worn these a couple of times. I'm going to assume because they're in such fantastic condition. So that's those. And then I have a pair of lugs. Which is these. And these again are brand new. They're women's. Um, they are the Flexistride Lugs Memory Foam, and these are in a size nine. So, yeah, that's these. Um, I, nothing to clean up on those, <laughs> but that's it for my very first video, and I want to thank you all for taking the time with me through this whole entire experience. I know I've taken a lot of your time, but hopefully you enjoyed it. And again, if you have any comments, any suggestions, leave them in the comments for me. I welcome it. I have more videos that I'm going to be putting out for you, showing you a lot more of my inventory. And I do purchase things almost on a daily basis. So I've got quite a few things coming in yet. And eventually I'm going to be doing some unboxings and so forth. And, um, yeah, so if you want to see me again in the future, you want to see what I got coming, I am on Poshmark and eBay. Please like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell button if you want to be notified of when my next video is coming. And I want to thank you so much for joining me today, and I hope you have an absolutely blessed day. We'll see you again soon. Thank you.